Monday morning, 28 years ago, Hurricane Andrew devastated South Florida. Yeah, on August 24th, 1992 as a Category 5. But keep in mind that Andrew also struck the Bahamas and Louisiana. And it really is incredible that now Louisiana and the Gulf Coast states are bracing for back-to-back -back tropical systems. First tropical storm, Marco is forecast to make landfall somewhere along the Louisiana coastline later on. And then Laura is anticipated to intensify into a hurricane, a category two potentially headed towards the Louisiana or Texas coastline as we head into the middle of the week. So here's the latest on tropical storm Laura, which is located 175 miles east southeast of Cayo Largo, Cuba. Max sustained winds of 65 miles an hour, moving west northwest at 21 miles an hour. Tropical storm warnings continuing for Cuba, the Grand Cayman, and now tropical storm warning is in effect as well for the middle and lower keys because although Laura is forecast to move across the Caribbean and parts of Cuba throughout the day today and stay to our south. The tropical storm force winds extend 175 miles out and away from the center and hence you're seeing that yellow area. That's where tropical storm conditions are likely here as we head throughout the day today. So it looks like the worst of our weather and the windiest weather will likely be in the afternoon and into the evening when Laura makes its closest approach and then continues to move off to the west and northwest into the Gulf of Mexico. Category one likely by tomorrow and then by Wednesday it could be a category two or even stronger possibly as it's moving over the warm waters of the Gulf of Mexico, low wind shear. This is fuel for this system to strengthen. And then eventually once it moves inland, it'll move north and northeast. But yeah, Tropical Storm Marco is first up though, moving northwest now. It is weekend, but Tropical Storm warnings are in effect here along the Gulf Coast from Mississippi to Louisiana coast. And yeah, Tropical Storm conditions likely later today once it makes landfall, dangerous storm surge. Also a big concern here for not only Louisiana and Texas, but also for Mississippi. And here's a look at Marco on the infrared satellite imagery. And then we're also seeing tropical storm Laura, where some of the deepest convection is to the south over the warm waters of the Caribbean. So Jamaica, Grand Cayman, Cuba, dealing with some nasty weather right now. Our winds are already increasing 22 to 29 miles an hour. Gusts as high as 30 to even 35 already. So secure any loose items throughout the day. The winds will continue to strengthen and build. And in terms of our impact, Tropical storm force winds will be possible. Wind gusts, I should say, 40 to 50 miles an hour. Wind advisories in effect through tomorrow, 2 a.m. Expect gusty squalls, rain bands, and the slight chance of water spouts and tornadoes for 